Oh, sorry about that, guys. I forgot my mic down. Okay, so this is um, this is what it should look like. And make sure here, who can submit this application? Make sure you select registered users, or else it just will be horrible. And um, if it's an application to like become staff or something on your server, keep this same. But if it's a review or something else, say submit review or submit whatever you're doing. So this is what the form should kind of look like maybe longer or whatever so the name it's not need no i'll fix that later I'll fix it right now actually just do edit to fix it i'll say not needed save changes okay and then what do you think of our channel it'll be bigger and then this yeah okay i keep saying okay i need to stop saying okay. so i'm done with so i'm just gonna exit it out and here's this okay so back to your admin panel and now, so once you have the pages to adjusted to your liking, um, you can get more into different stuff. So go to users, and um, so basically, be like if you have a Minecraft server or something, or something, or you want or whatever, um, what you can do is you can make something that goes before their name. So I'm actually gonna go settings. Permanent tag. Okay, I'm not sure what that is. But what you can do is you can say user tags. Oh, that is. So user tags. So you can tag. I'm gonna name this tag owner, cause I am the owner of this whatever it's called. And you don't need a link to the tag or whatever. But then make the tag color. I want the tag color to be blue, cause I. Or yeah, I'm gonna keep that blue. And then I'm gonna make the prefix owner. And if this the prefix color, I'm gonna make red. And then the custom post color is going to be purple. And I'll show you what that is later. And then this is where it gets fun. The username special effect. I'm and this may make your thing slow, so I'm just gonna do a glow. Cause I don't want this to be bad for YouTube. I might change it later. And then when you want to give someone that owner, that tag, click their name, say tag users. And say, and I'm gonna say whatever tag. And if you want the tag to expire after two days or whatever, you can say this, and then you can edit these or whatever. But I don't want it to take. I don't want it to expire, so I'm gonna say tag will not expire, and then say save changes. And then I'm gonna go up here. And I'm gonna refresh the page. Now watch the name when it finishes refreshing. Let's see. It's gonna be done here soon after it becomes blank. Okay, so there you go, owner, like that. And now I, um, let me see something. I don't, yeah, I don't like, you see how it's blue? I don't like the blue, so I'm actually going to change that. This will be like what color name is. I'm going to change that to a green, and then I'm going to save it. And go here, refresh. Okay, and then while refreshing, um, you can make more tags. These are all I'm making. And then... Okay, okay, now this is what I need. I keep saying okay. Go to settings. Website description. Okay, I'm just going to say. Copy. I'm going to add an apostrophe there. Apostrophe there. Okay, and then down, your community site, or your community slash website logo. I'm going to change that, and I'll show you how to do that later. Okay, so website type, I'm going to say other, no, other. Website country, you don't have to do this. I'm actually going to do so. Ooh, is it under America? No, it's under United States. Darn it. United States. Okay. And what you can do is time setting, let's see. U.S. and... U.S. Wow. Oh. I don't even live in Denver, but that's okay. Format. Share website. Okay, where where's what I'm looking for? Here, I'm just going to quick say that. So you can edit that to your liking or whatever. And then say save changes. 